are now in the dispensation of a prayer. Uh, God's anointing touching life. And uh, the revival we started on Monday. We were about to finish it this morning. And uh, God has been faithful. Indeed, He has been doing wonders in our midst, in our lives. And uh, truly, He is a miracle worker. And then, the next program is our monthly program. And then, coincidentally, we are doing it with our praise nights and then with our convention. And then, we call it Only Out of the Rock. Our father, Pastor Emmanuel Odejobi, he has started where God has been really, 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 really using him. And then we believe that this morning is going to be a new dawn for us. Amen. Bigger amen. amen. As a new day has break forth this morning, as it is recorded in the book of Jeremiah, that as it's not possible for a man to stop the breaking of a new day, my covenant with the nation of Israel shall not be broken. Amen. We believe that a new day is appearing now. Before the sun will rise, our expected miracle will manifest. Amen. Before the sun will rise today, the yoke that makes us weary shall disappear. Amen. Before the sun will rise today, I believe and I trust God that all of us in this auditorium, we are going to carry pregnancy of testimonies. Yeah. What you cannot do in the past, you will do it. Yeah. But as our father will be coming to the podium, I want to read the book of Deuteronomy chapter 20, 32, verses 12 to 14. Deuteronomy 32, 12 to 14 says, so the Lord alone did live in, and there was no strange God with him. He made him ride on the high places of the earth, that he might eat the increase of the fields. And he made him to suck only out of the rock. For only to come out of the rock is an impossible thing for man, something that is not possible. But God will do it. In this land where we find ourselves, people say that life is hard and difficult. But God will make it easy. In this situation of the world, there is economic downgrading, financial problem all over the world. But He promised that He will open the floodgates. Why other will walk in darkness? the light of the Almighty God will go with us. Yeah. So let's put our hands together for Jesus. And then, as our Father, our Father will come to the glory of
this program. Then I pleaded rest for this midnight. But uh, the man of God insisted that I just have to say something. And I'm happy to stand before you, being representative of Almighty God, mouthpiece of God, to tell you his mind concerning that uh, honey out of the rock. Briefly, I will talk. I only want to open our understanding what exactly rock is about and what honey is about. Father, we thank you because forever you are the Lord. You are the Lord that changes not. You remain forever in diminish in power and you deteriorate not in glory. That is why we stand upon the platform of faith to declare exactly what you are for your people to see you the more and to rejoice in the beauty of your holiness and begin to walk in the light of your word and our life begin to declare your glory without termination. Amen. Everlasting Father be thou exalted. Stars temple constant prima shine on the Bakata. See volume Paul and be Katroda Astahor. Right from heavenly home upon your majestic throne. You bestow your love upon our life and open our understanding. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. As I have pleaded in Jesus' name. Amen. Be seated. Each being water out of the wells of salvation from Monday. It is another thing this midnight. Water out of the wells of salvation. But another biblical metaphoric expression this midnight. Something greater than the one we've been dealing with from Monday. Honey out of the rock. Join with me as we quickly go into the Holy Scripture. We want to read from two, just two extracts. Let every one of us that hold this our Bible open to Luke chapter 20 and we read it in chorus. Chapter 20, verse 17. Have you done that? Yes, sir. Then shall we read? And he beheld them and said, What is the day that is written? The stone which the builders rejected, the same is become the head of the corner. And let uh, my mother go this time to read now. And he beheld them and said, what is this then that is written? The stone which the builders rejected. The, the stone same, which the builder rejected. The same is because the, they The had rock it. which the builders rejected. Who are the builders? The scribes. The Pharisees. And the the enemies of the cross. The stone which the builders rejected, uh -huh. the same is become the head of the corner. The same is become the head of the corner. I 
I want to talk briefly on the message of the cross. You talk of rock that over honey. You talk of cross of Christ. So strong, so tough. Not easily dug to excavate such thing we are talking about. To dig well, uh, so a bit simple. But to dig rock, to dig well to tap water is what we've been dealing with from Monday. And now, honey from the rock. You know what it means. That very stone rejected by the builders. Then you take reading before I minister briefly. First Corinthians chapter 1, verses 18 and 19. Let Mama quickly read that. For the preaching of the cross is to them that perish foolishness. Them that perish, preaching of the cross is nothing but foolishness. Yes? But unto us which are saved, it unto is the power us of God. which are saved, what's it? It is the power of God. Power of God. Then I want to interpret. So we talk of rock that over milk. It isn't any other thing but the cross of Jesus Christ. And I will show you the honeycomb concerning the body of Christ. We dealt extensively concerning words that over water of salvation. I detailed it where I place it sequently. Number one word that over water of salvation, that is birth of Jesus Christ. Number two word that over water of salvation, that has to do with work and work of Jesus Christ. W-A-L-K all about and W-O-R-K all about. The number three that over us water of salvation has to do with a sovereign. Sovereign indeed. Is sovereign. Is sovereign. And over us water of salvation. Number four, as sequently stated, has to do with uh, after sovereign, then he was crucified. Death of Jesus Christ. Number five, well, that over water for salvation is resurrection of Jesus Christ. Number six, as been stated, has to do with ascension of Jesus Christ. Whosoever believe that step, the seven steps, or what we what are telling us is about six part, water port, are the entrance of a place where a ceremony of marriage was being conducted those days in the book of John. And that of woman with six concubines, I've told you. You talk of six, number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, number six, words that over were. We've done that. But now, honey, out of the rock. What's it about? The rock that over only has four cardinal points. That is the cross of Jesus Christ. The only come, western only come, that is left hand of Christ on the cross that shed blood. That very blood is what you call honey. Blood on the left hand of Jesus Christ because of crucifixion. Over honey. And that honey has to do 
with the name of Jesus Christ. We have for indelible heritage that over us only we are talking about. But it's not all that is it. By the time the nerd is left hand, as if we are talking of digging that rock to over us only, blood out of it, give us the name of Jesus Christ. It's no more physical issue, but his name remains. As come of only. And that is why Bible declared. Whatever you ask in my name, I will do. Is that not some only? Just make a mention of one's name and become recipient of all things you need. But what do you think of the day people don't get to that uh, extent of provision of that only, which is blood? Only blood is name, and uh, when we again go further concerning goodness in his name, you, I'm sure you can, will not forget. By the time uh, uh, written in book of Psalm 23, somewhere there is a because of his name, even. If I walk in the valley of death, I fear no evil. That is to say that left hand, dog as far as excavating oil, self as protective device, protecting us against evil before Who will ever not over praises to God whose left hand over only of protection? Against it will, it will be falling. In his name, you see in Matthew chapter 1, verse 21, stated that uh, we will name him Jesus because by that name he is going to deliver his people. Is it not sound only? And that other blood of deliverance. And uh, in verse 23 of the same book, then he said it's going to be called Emmanuel. That is to say, God with man. Just his name. Now listen. By the time we were born into this world, we born horizontally. That is minus sign. Minus sign. But someone just be a name that had God to man. The interpretation of Emmanuel is God is with us. And we have been separated by reason of sinful act, provocative and grievous commitment of us other. God discarded us out of paradise as un as if unuseful vessel. We were all drove out. And now someone came and bear name Emmanuel. And the interpretation now, God with us. That name that attract the presence of God to be added to we minus man, this man come vertically and cross our minus. This is what I'm saying. We born negative. We born negative. But someone now surrender himself. He plays aside garment glory of God. And he jumped right from heaven vertically. By the time this man was coming, then God with man, Imam El, Imam El. Man minus God before. Man minus God. Man minus grace. We first 
short of grace, glory of God, which contents us to do with grace, that is good things free of charge, peace, and the third contents of that grace has to do with life. But someone came and bear wonderful name, Emmanuel. Now, man with God. Minus now turn plus. That plus you call cross. That is a, a, a vertical man, cross horizontal man, then to make our minus to become plus. Then this is the message of the cross that uh, brought about only. The rock of Christ is what we call rock because it is not easily dug to, 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 to excavate and what we call it, uh, honey. Honey number one, from the left hand of Jesus Christ, that blood shed by the time he was nailed. That is a uh, Western army from the comb of his right, left hand. Only comb number two, his right hand, blood, by the time he was nailed, then blood came out. That blood served as only cardinal number two. And that has to do with the word of God in which we take life. In John chapter 1, verse 4, it stated, In the word of God is life. And life is about something that will enable us, even if at all we are supposed to be uh, buried, we are in the sepulchre. Life in us will offer us grace to come out. What do you think of yam caught by a farmer, which happens not to lose life? Lively yam, yam that is not yet cooked. And a farmer now come out to tell us, I've killed it by well-sharpened cutlass. Cut its head, cut it to three parts, and become digger of the grave. That same man that cut yam, dig, or I mean, what do you call it? We are, is going to be buried. And is the one that served the purpose of pastoral right. He conducts service of burial and uh, lay on it even what you call you normally place on it. They say what you have and one lay it down. Then some days to come, that young by the time is being buried, it was with uh, I mean head color but coming out green. And at the end of the day, when you search for the other time killed young by the army farmer, then you could bring it out bigger than the previous. And no mark of court again. Isn't that only That is the work of life. Life will enable you to be dominated. Even if we might have been buried, within the general mass of the head of poverty, general mass of the head of failure, general mass of the head of bankruptcy, general head of the mass, be it matrimonial problem, be it financial, be it material, be it social, be it mental, whatever trouble into which one might have been buried, you have life in you, by reason of your concern and concentration with the word of God, it is the word of God that over life. So you have that life in you. If at all you are supposed to be killed or something killed you, you just don't worry. You come out in another color. So because of life in you, life in you will ensure growth no matter how, I, I mean, your enemy will war against you no matter how enmity created against you. You just see that you grow in it. With life in you, not mere germination. Out of sepulchre, 
of poverty, sepulchre of trouble, sepulchre of whatever you think about. You, you don't see that you grow. The farmer that did that evil work to young planted, before you know it, it will come above that farmer. Above that farmer. By reason of growth because of life in it. And that life will enable it to bear fruit. Bearing fruit has to do with life in you. If you are lifeless, you just see that you are hopeless. And uh, uh, life could not be taken from any other cardinal, but the cardinal number two, the comb of that only right hand of Jesus Christ, being nailed and blood come out. Blood side number two over honeycomb number two. Where you take honey of life, the word of God. And the word of God being compared to fire through prophet Jeremiah in chapter 23. You know the efficacy of burning fire. Wherever fire burns, you take it effect for consumption of dust and pollution. You take light effect for revelation of things hidden that you might have been looking for that are not yet seen. When it is light, then you see. It was even tedious for maker of the heaven and earth at the beginning. In the beginning, it was it there for death, but it was formless. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Void and darkness. It was in devil before these three things emanated. And no one will ever trace where commit these three evils. It was in devil there. But the Bible does not place us into darkness concerning situation of God. God was in, in dilemma. He was troubled. His spirit of upon the deep. That is, God was running a task letter. What's the next line of action? How do I get out of this predicament? How do I escape this trouble? Then immediately he remembered Jesus Christ wasn't then dear Jesus. He was then light. Light. He said, let there be light. As if one said, let there be Christ. At the moment it was light, then formlessness fled, void, darkness nowhere to be found again. It was then he was able to do all things of his heart desire. So, that is only number two. That's the right hand of blood on his right hand because of being nailed. However, only number two, that is the word of God, where we take life. It is only for you. You take life because of blood shed on his right hand on the cross. You have another bottle of only. Only comb number three has to do with his two legs. Nails together. That is southern only comb. Then that over us, the other one over us, name of Christ, the other one word of Christ, then the, the southern one of us, blood of Jesus Christ, for cleansing and purification, the mover of all that and pollution. Who will not joyously rejoice before someone who happens to be the rock that over us that kind of 